when you first found out, when you first talked to Lay, how was he when he said, "Hey, dog, they gave it. I'm, I'm the coach, dog." Like, how was he when you when you talked to him? <laughs> so the crazy thing about it, he told me um a night before. Okay. That's my best friend. So as people don't know, that's that was my college roommate, my best friend. We talked every day. Right. Um. So he told me the night before, like, man, I got a meeting in the morning with like the second of command. Mm. And he was talking about rich and stuff like that. And I'm like, bro, don't you got meetings in the morning? He was like, man, they told me to come meet with them. <laughs> so in our mind, we was like, man, they might be about to fire on Harsey. Right. But we weren't thinking that. I mean, we weren't, you know what I'm saying? We didn't think that for sure, but it was like, that might be a possibility. Right. And it was kind of a joke, like, boy, they about to name you head coach. <laughs> <laughs> And then, man, that next that next day, he told me like, "Hey, Lowe's, man, they they done named your boy head coach." I was like, "For real?" Right. He was like, "Yeah." He said, "Man, they talked to him, just talking about how much they need him, how much you know Auburn need him to do this and step up." He was like, "What me? I ain't ready for that." Right. And they just told him they need you know they got your back and you know what I'm saying you'll get through it or whatever the case may be. You know he was happy about it, man. He said it's a lot, it's a lot that right. goes on into it, but you know he's really happy about it. 